Hi, I'm Dr. Rashmi Ravindra. I'm consultant dermatologist and cosmetic dermatologist. My clinic Minakshi Cosmo Derma Care is at Arkere Micro Layout, Banargatta Road. I also consult at BGS Global Hospital, Uttarali Road, near Kengiri. Yeah. Yes, uh, exposure to certain chemicals will cause white skin and it's not vitiligo. Vitiligo is, uh, it has genetic predisposition and it is autoimmune. Not all uh, white skin is vitiligo, but vitiligo is definitely a white skin disease. That is leucoderma, what we call it. People working in factories, for example, leather factories, they are exposed for monobenzyl ether of hydroquinone. They are more prone for contact leucoderma, that is called contact uh, white skin. So it's not vitiligo, it is contact induced depigmentation. And also uh, at workplace like uh, uh, aliphatic and aromatic uh, compounds of phenols and catechols, those chemicals are more prone for contact leucoderma. Also, certain chemicals in uh, cosmetic products, for example, azo dyes in lipstick, eyeliners and uh, lip liners, as well as uh, PPD, that is uh, PPD in hair dyes will cause uh, uh, contact leucoderma, as well as in chemicals like a PTBP compound in uh, perfumes and deodorants will cause contact leucoderma and it is not contact vitiligo. So, it is called contact depigmentation or contact leucoderma.